Welcome back, everybody, to Pick My Solar's Facebook Live. Rex Kehoe with Patrick Crowley himself. We have a pretty fun topic today, as always. I think we might have a question, though, before we, we get started here. We love those. Uh, so this was, I believe, from last week from Karen. Has anyone ever had their solar panels stolen? And if so, are they insured from theft? I have never heard of one of our customers having their panels stolen. I'm sure it's, it's probably happened. It's definitely happened, but yeah, not to our customers. Uh, it would not be something that's covered from manufacturer's Sorry. warranties or anything like that, but once you get your system installed, let your insurance, your homeowner's insurance know, yeah. you will be covered. And a lot of times they're not gonna even raise your premium or, or anything like that. So yes, you would be covered, but you do need to, to report that. Um, to your homeowner's insurance. Good question. Interesting visual of somebody. Yeah, there, that would be disconnecting them. Quite the task. Not getting electrocuted. It'd be yeah, pretty, I feel like you're going to hear people stomping around on your roof as well. It would Guess be you a, if you're not home, a low value, high skill theft. Right. So I can't imagine. Yeah. That's what's going. You'd on have to know there. how to get them taken off too. You'd almost have to be. Right. Yeah, a contractor yourself. Mm-hmm. Anyway. Um, Ask us anything, write us a comment, give us a call, we will answer it all for you. So today's topic, Sun Power Equinox. This is number Deep Dive 80. So, you know, definitely a, a premium product. We're going to go through the details, kind of, the, you know, the benefits of why you would go with Sun Power with their Equinox system. Um, yeah, it's a very good product. You know, our installers do offer this. Not everybody, um, but we'll, we'll go into the highlights here. So, what makes SunPower Equinox different from you know any other solar panel provider? Right. So, what's I think particularly special about the SunPower Equinox system is everything is contained under one roof. So, a lot of times yep. with you know this the bigger selling point of SunPower and talking about sure. efficiency is all the warranties for the panels, the inverters, the monitoring, and now the storage are going to be contained under one umbrella, one company to call when something goes wrong. Yep. Uh, you know, I've had good experiences with Solar Edge and Pays as an inverter and then the many other panel manufacturers and things go wrong. It's not that difficult, but a lot of people like that. Hey, I've got one point of contact. Right. If anything goes wrong, these things are all meant and designed to work together. Yep. Not that other things aren't, but just having everything under one roof, or not one roof, yeah. but you, know, <laughs> they, you want them on top of the roof. Right. Having things under the same company's umbrella yeah. can be helpful when, right. whenever you need to diagnose anything. Hopefully you don't, but if you do, it's one number to one call. One number to call. Yeah, and you're not going to have, you know... And they'll not, be able to solve all your issues as well. That's we'll true. Say, it's not the panel, it's the inverter. It's not right. the inverter, it's the panel. Exactly. You're going to get your answer because there's only yep. one person to call. Yeah, but, you know, nobody's going to be able to kind of point the finger at the other. Yeah. For but, sure. But basically, you know, sun power, by and large, at this point, everything is a built-in microinverter. Most of their panels at this point, they still have some uh, some panels that don't. That yeah, the DC standard. modules. Yeah, the DC modules right. require an, a, another inverter. Uh, but most of the Equinox, I do believe. Is yep, that, that Equinox has the system. integrated inverter, right. Right, I mean, even think, I even think down to the racking, the combat, yep. everything is under that umbrella. The monitoring system, you can log right onto your, your phone, your tablet, computer, mm -hmm. whatever, and you know, check it all out. Right. And of course, the panels as well. Yep, yeah, the racking uh, Invisimount is what, what SunPower calls it, but yeah, it, it's also, um, you know, the racking is also um, from SunPower, so. Uh, yeah, and I mean, you know, I don't think anybody's going to argue that, you know, SunPower, it, it's the best product out there when it comes to mm -hmm. the efficiency. I don't think anybody's really going to argue with that. No doubt. Um, you know, the things that you got to consider is, you know, are do you want to pay that premium? I mean, do you want the Cadillac for your, your solar system? Sometimes, yes, that is uh, a wise choice if, you know, we've gone over this in other segments, but, you know, if you have limited roof space and you really need to... You know, get the most out of it square footage wise and pack as much power as you can in that confined area sun power you know could be a really good option for you um, if you have a huge roof and, and you can fit you know as much you know as many panels as needed with a you know 300 watt panel or something like that from a cost standpoint that's probably going to be you know a better option but you know nobody like i said they're not going to argue sun power is you know the, the, the top of the line mm -hmm. um, product no doubt Okay, so 
There is uh, an energy storage system. So I believe our colleague Annie was telling us this is going to be available in November. For pre-order. For pre-order. Yes, which means yes. 2020, and we know how these announcements go in the solar <laughs> industry. So hopefully 2020, this yep. is something you're starting to be able to get with your right. sun power system. You can get third-party backup right now with your sun power system. But right. this is, again, that effort that sun power is making to put everything under one single umbrella. Uh, the storage system is going to be AC coupled. Right. It's going to be very, you know, for, that just means it's going to work with just about anything. That you yeah. need. It's going to be very easy to use. Um, probably, I'd imagine it's going to be right integrated. We haven't seen it yet, but right integrated with that Equinox app. I uh, think so, the, yeah. The Hub Plus is, it seems to be the attachment here that's coming with that storage system. Mm -hmm. And that will allow you to throttle when and how you use that stored energy, time of use load shifting, which we've gone over in the past. Right. You can really maximize your solar production. And again, the more components you add, so the monitoring, the battery. All under one company. All under the nice. same thing. And so yeah. you, I would imagine you're going to be able to control all of that, monitor all of that, all from the exact same app. Right. Which is really cool. That right? is. But, you know, it's, it's, it's a yeah. very cool thing. And, you know, not, we, we've talked about the cost, but if, yeah. if you're going Sun Power, you're, you're, you're going to be a happy really cool with it. product. Yeah. Right, for yeah. sure. And you know, as Patrick mentioned, I mean, this the, in, in terms of the battery storage, uh, currently, yeah, this is AC coupled, so your Tesla Powerwall, your Sonin, I think maybe Pika you could use with that. The one battery you would not be able to use with the, um, the SunPower Equinox with the AC uh, modules would be your LG Chem. Mm -hmm. That's a DC coupled system. It does need to be paired with a very specific inverter. It's uh, called the Solar Edge Storage Inverter. Um, but I believe with SunPower, some of the older, I wouldn't say older, but their DC modules, they would work with Solar Edge. So you, you could get um, an LG battery if you really wanted with SunPower. Just wouldn't be this this Equinox yeah, SunPower right, system. Right. And then uh, the so I, I don't know if this is widely known, but I mean these integrated. Uh, I guess we can talk about. It. We're pretty transparent on the show, so you know the the integrated microinverters that SunPower uses, they're in phase. I mean that that's no you know in the industry it's not a secret. Uh, end phase makes the microinverters, um, and I know that Enphase does have a product that's supposed to come out next year, the IQ8. Mm. We don't know if that's going to come out or not, you know, in in next year, but that's kind of what they're uh, they're calling for, which is going to have this kind of uh, battery storage component to it. I would imagine, you know, this product that uh, SunPower is uh, promoting now has something to do with that IQ8. Yeah, certainly. Yeah, but it does seem also to be its own storage system. Which right. I think the, the, the IQ8 is really high levels, effectively an inverter that allows you to operate a closed loop, right. which may or may not get you know, approved by the electrical and fire codes. Yeah, that's because true. Because it's a little bit challenging right. to, to not have that shut off and have that self-contained loop, especially when you're connected with the grid. Right. Really, really cool technology. I think we're all Hopefully, excited. Yeah, that'd be for awesome. It. Right. Uh, but there's always that challenge. I don't know that that's quite uh, what that storage is. Mm -hmm. However, that IQ8 if it does get that approval, it's going to be integrated. Just right. with SunPower as well, I imagine. Yeah, for sure. So kind of the how it works here, you know, Patrick went over this, but you know, all in one complete system, all with the same company here, which is very, very cool. Uh, technical details, I think you just a little bit more here. You guys can scroll back through the video if you want to get uh, a little bit more details on the actual product there. It's pretty similar to the, uh, to the Powerwall, it looks like. Yeah. Yeah, you know, the 13. Yep, for sure. And 10 year warranty, which mm -hmm. is, is uh, you know, also what the Powerwall has. That's pretty much it. So very cool product. Uh, you know, definitely something to consider, you know, when you're looking into going solar, but it is going to come at a premium. So definitely a factor, um, you know, that you're going to want to consider as well. As always, you know, Pick My Solar, we operate an online solar marketplace. So come to us, we'll do an independent analysis for your project. See if solar makes sense for you. We'll get you the top bids from local companies that we have vetted in your area. And yeah, it's, it's as simple as that. Sure is. Awesome. Everyone have a great weekend. We will see you next week.